Hello students, today I am going to explain you the different type of division questions. As you see, the first question on my paper is 75 divided by 5. Placement remains the same. On the left hand side corner, first dot we have to place the divisor that is 5 and dividend will be placed after the center dot. This is 1's rod and this is 10's rod. So, after the 1's rod, we need to place the dividend. Now, the first digit of dividend is greater than divisor. In that case, we have to place the dividend on the 10's rod. Now, we have to read the table of 5 for 7 because 7 is greater. In that case, we will not take both the digits. So, 5, 1's are 5. Now, in the second step, we will take the second digit, that is 5. So, now I have number 25. So, 5, 5's are 25. My answer is 1, 5, 15. And nothing is remaining, so remainder becomes 0. Next question is 64. Placement will remain same, divided by 4. Now again, the first digit of dividend is greater than the divisor. So, we will leave one rod and placement of answer will be from the tens rod. So, 4, 1's are 4. 5 goes 1 comes, you all know. Now, 4, 6's are 24. Second digit we have to take in the second step. So, the answer is 1, 6, 16. And nothing is remaining. It means remainder is 0. Next question is again 46 divided by 2. So, table of 2 for 4 it is greater. So, again we will take 1 by 1. 2, 2 is 4. Second digit we will take in the second step. 2, 3 is 6. So, the answer is 23 and remainder is 0. 23 Remainder becomes 0. Next again, 69 divided by 3. 3 table for 6. Again, it is greater. So, we have to place our answer from 10's rod. 3, 2's are 6. And second step, second digit, 3, 3's are 9. So, answer is again 23 and remainder is 0. So, we will again write 23. Remainder becomes 0. Now, 85 divided by 4. Again, 4, 8. So, we have to read the table of 4 for 8. 4, 2 is 8. Now, 5 is there and we have 4. We cannot do 4, 2 is So, we have to do 4, 1 is 4, 1 is 4. 5 goes, 1 comes. In this question, we are getting something as a remainder. So, the answer becomes 21 is the question and we got 1 as a remainder. So, we have to write 1 in the bracket. Do all these questions two times to have better understanding. Thank you so much.